Hello, this is Father Mike Hennethan, pastor at St. Joachim Catholic Church in Costa Mesa, California, for another edition of, in case you missed it. Today at Mass was a really interesting day because the Gospel talks to us about how important the Eucharist is. We have the story of, of, of the, the two disciples. We know one's name is Clopas. We don't know the name of the other one. It's Easter evening. They're walking to a town called Amos, which is about seven miles from downtown Jerusalem of the day. So, and they were discussing about the res, you know, the death of Jesus and his re the word of his resurrection. They're trying to figure out what it all means. Jesus walks with them along the road. He explains to them uh, what the scriptures said about the Messiah. He looked like he was going to go on further. We see that uh, the, uh, the disciples invite Jesus to stay with them. They have a meal. He takes bread. He says the blessing. He broke the bread and gave it to them. And it came to their, you know, to their awareness that it had been Jesus was who was with them. And so, uh, anyway, Jesus disappears. They run back to Jerusalem to tell the apostles that uh, the Lord had appeared to them. And then they said, "Weren't our hearts burning within us as he explained the scriptures to them, to us?" Didn't we come to know him in the breaking of the bread? So that's uh, what the gospel for today is all about. What it, what it says to us is that there are two things here that is so prevalent in our modern day liturgies or modern day Eucharist, which is the breaking open of the word of God, the pro proclamation of the sacred scripture readings, and then also the breaking of the bread, the liturgy of the Eucharist. So we have the liturgy of the word, the liturgy of the Eucharist that, that, we, that, is, that is a part of um, the scripture reading, I mean, uh, of our uh, worship service here as Catholics. And then, of course, the homily is breaking open it so that it, we find meaning, just like Jesus tried to explain the meaning of the scriptures as well. In fact, the word homily means like unrolling a scroll, just like you would uh, in Jesus' day unroll the scroll of scriptures. So what we see is that we as Catholics celebrate in the same way we, that, that Christians have been doing so for the last 2,000 years. So, and I hope when we are able to get back to Mass, when we're able to open the doors of the church and celebrate the Mass again, that we'll all have our hearts burning uh, in when we hear the word proclaimed and that we come to know Jesus again in the breaking of the bread. Thank you. Have a wonderful day.